Hello everyone. Welcome to today's presentation on how to use back office in Goodwill. In this video presentation on Goodwill back office, we will be teaching you how to log into back office and how to check your ledger and other details in back office as well as download your profit and loss statement. First off, let us start off with how you will go about logging into your back office. To be redirected to the back office page, simply scan the QR code present at the bottom right hand corner. Or you can simply choose to visit our website gwcindia.in, go to my login and click on back office. You will be redirected to this page. In the select login type box, simply select client login and click submit. The QR code which has been provided in our previous page will redirect you directly to this particular web page. As you can see here, CAPS FO 2021 refers to the financial year for which you would like to check your trading details. If you would like to change the financial year, for example, you had opened your account in 2019 and you would like to check out your details of trade in 2019, simply change the financial year. In order to log into back office, simply click on the forgot password option. Here, input your client ID as well as your PAN number in caps and click on request password. You'll receive a prompt here which says password has been sent to your email and mobile ID. Now check your registered mobile number for the temporary password which has been sent to you. Enter the password which you have received via SMS in this old password box and then set a new password and click on change password. Your password has been changed successfully. Now you can come back to the sign in page here. Enter your client ID and the password which you have just set just now and sign in. As you can see the first page will show you your current account balance as well as your branch details. As of now I have not added any funds to my trading account and you can see that my balance reflects 0.00 CR that means zero balance. Now let us check out the ledger and other details which will be available in your back office. Just as an example this is a sample screenshot of your ledger in case you have done some trades in your account. As you can see the pay in and pay outs have been clearly mentioned. The bill entries which you can see here refer to the trading profit and loss for that particular trading day. Now let us toggle back to our back office platform. We are back to our back office platform. Now in case you are looking to check your trade details simply go and click on smart. Since I have not done any trades currently you can see that my ledger is completely blank. In order to download your ledger statement simply click on statement download and a PDF of the same will be downloaded. To check your holdings, simply click on holding. Let me remind you that since I have not yet invested any amount, it has been shown as a blank. Ledger can also be used to check your ledger statement. Here you can choose to download your profit and loss or ledger statement by selecting all exchanges. Mention the date from which date to which date you would like to download the statement and simply click on PDF statement. Since I have not yet done any trades in this account. No PDF statement has been downloaded for me. Now let us go back to the smart screen. In case you have any holdings in your DMAT account, it will also be shown here in this particular area. To check your trade details, you can simply click on trade. To check your open positions, you can click on position. Since I have no positions open right now, you can see that no positions have been found message has popped up. For margin details, you can click on margin. Global details will show you the details of all the scripts in which you have traded. While global detail will show you the same thing except it will be segregated by the exact dates as well. Under KYC, you will be able to see your personal details which have been updated in your back office. To download your contract note, you can simply go to bills and contracts and click on contract note. Since I have not done any trades after opening my account, you can see that it is blank. Usually, all the trades that you have done between the dates which have been mentioned here can be viewed as entries. Even the contract notes may be downloaded from this particular screen. To check out your 
global profit and loss statement, click on global P&L report. As you can see, you have the option to select the exchange. Suppose you would like a common profit and loss statement for all segments, simply select EQ, DER, COM as well as CURR. Select the date from which to which you would like download or view your profit and loss statement and simply click on view. Apart from this, you can also download your DP holding statement. Simply select the date for which you would like to get the holding statement and click on view or click on statement to download the PDF for the same. In order to log out, simply click on log out. With this, we come to an end of our presentation on how to log into back office and how to check your ledger and profit and loss details. We would like to thank you for watching this video. For any support related queries or further details, feel free to email us at customer support at the rate gwcindia.in or WhatsApp us at 733-889-5491 or call us at 044-4032-9999.